This Japanese dessert is a sweet, buttery magic that will leave your heart hankering like a fool. Today we are making Dora cake. In Japanese, Dora means gong, and maybe because of its shape, this is known as Doriyaki. Yeah, of course not because it's Doraemon's favorite. To start with, you will need 5 tablespoon warm milk. Remember, not boiling but warm. You will need to make this really sweet by adding 10 tablespoons of powdered sugar. And mixing half a teaspoon vanilla essence. Stir it thoroughly so that it mixes well. First, you will need to refrigerate the solution for at least 2 hours. Get yourself 2 packets of Oreos from the store. We will need only the biscuits, not the cream inside. So I am gonna scoop them out for my morning cup of coffee. Have you ever tried that? Put them in a mixer and grind them into a fine powder. Pour 3 4th cup of milk and 1 tablespoon sugar in the mixer. Now grind it again. Here, our Dora cake batter is almost ready. See this? The texture should be slurry. If it's thicker than this, then you should add a little bit milk in it. Add about 1 teaspoon baking powder. This will help to make the cake all soft and fluffy. Make sure to mix it thoroughly. Now, brush the pan with oil and pour the batter. These cakes are very delicate, so the temperature needs to be really low. Flip the Dora cake after 2 minutes. Cook the other side as well for another 2 minutes. Now, you just have to repeat the same process for the remaining batter. See? So soft and fluffy. Let's prepare the buttercream. In a bowl, add 100 gram unsalted butter. Remember, it should be softened and not melted. Whisk it till the color changes to off-white and becomes frothy like this. It should take about 5 to 6 minutes. Now, you need the milk and sugar syrup that we prepared earlier. Pour the syrup a little at a time and keep whisking. You will notice that the cream is changing its texture. Keep whisking till you run out of the sugar syrup. And there, you have the buttercream ready. Spread it evenly over the Dora cakes and you will have your perfect plate of Japanese Doriakis. Let's see how it turned out. Mmm, sweet and velvety. Just melts in your mouth. 
Share this recipe of warm delight with your loved ones. And hey, don't forget to hit that like button.